I mean, are y'all are y'all seeing it? Are you seeing it? Like. Welcome back or welcome to my channel. So today I got something for y'all. We're gonna be reviewing this HD lace wig that I have on from Superb Wigs. Okay, undetectable. Exactly what it says, undetectable lace. I know I didn't film a video last week, but if you don't follow me on my social medias, then you don't know that I had the flu, so I was not feeling it. I was really trying, I was like, I need to film, I need to film. I'm like, really trying to push myself to get out of the bed and film, but just couldn't do it, like I just couldn't do it. So that's why there was no video last week, but we're back and better this week, and I got some heat coming up for y'all the next few weeks and on my future videos, cause I always come with the heat, so. Also, I know there is a change of scenery. I'm in my bedroom. I usually don't film in here because as you can see, it's a mess. Like, it's a lot going on. This room is just a mess. Like, there's just stuff everywhere. It's stuff, like, I have stuff in boxes and stuff, like, in a group because I want to redo my room, which is why I don't film in here because I just don't think it's fit to be filming in. Like, I just don't like the background. It just don't look good to me. I don't know. It's just, like, I don't like filming here. So, I usually film in the living room, but there was no room to film in there on Christmas because that's when I filmed the install so and I was like might as well just finish up the video in here even though I'm filming the intro and outro and the review portion after Christmas but I just had to go ahead and finish it up in here but um yeah that's why I'm in my bedroom for this video because there was no room in the living room to film so yeah, um, I filmed this install on Christmas. I'm filming this, it's, let's see, it's December 27th, so I'm filming it two days after Christmas. I was filming the install on Christmas, um, but I couldn't really do the intro and outro and everything like that because there are people here, we host Christmas here, so there are people here, there's a lot of noise going on, so I just decided to wait to do the intro and the outro for another day after everyone's gone. Or, you know, the noise kind of goes down a little bit. But, um, yeah. So, we're going to be installing this HD Lace wig today from Superb Wigs. And I'll be reviewing it after the install portion of the video. Now, the install is really sped up because I already have a detailed video on how I install my wig. So, there was no need for me to do all that for it to sit there and make y'all watch all that, you know. Waste time, okay, waste time. So if y'all wanna see a more detailed version, you know, all the products, everything, all the steps I take, me talking through it, I will link that below, but I already have a video on that, so. It's not like I was rushing or anything like that. And that's the thing, like the time, the time it took me to install this wig, this is the fastest I've ever installed a wig. The time it took me to film it was like, after I put all the clips together, it was like 20 minutes worth of footage. Not including the 10 minutes I take to like tie down the lace while it's melting. Um, so if you want to include that, then 30 minutes. But it took me 20 minutes to install this wig. That's the fastest and easiest I've ever installed a wig. Like this is the easiest install I've ever done. The most flawless install I've ever done. Like you're looking at it. You're looking at it. Like there's nothing to even say. Like. And yeah, that's why it seems like really, really fast because it really actually didn't take me that long to do. So, um, yeah, it's not like I was rushing or anything. It's just I don't feel the need to go through every single step when I have a completely separate video, a detailed video on how I start my week. So, after the install portion of the video, then we'll get into the review. So, stay tuned to the end because I'll be reviewing the hair, my thoughts on the hair and giving you all the details on the hair if you want to purchase it yourself you know the length the density everything like that so if you want to see how i achieve this look then keep on watching
All right, so now that we've gotten through the install, y'all see how I installed this wig. Y'all see how that lace melted. Y'all see how bomb that lace is. How quick and easy I did that install. Let's get into the specs on this wig so y'all can go purchase it because you need it. I'm telling you right now, you need it in your life. I'm just going to tell you that right now. So let's get into it. So this is the box that the wig came in from Superb Wigs. And I'll just, um, I filmed an unboxing when I got the wig. So when I filmed it, that was my first time opening it. So um, I filmed the unboxing for y'all. So I'm just going to place that clip over this while I'm talking. So it came with the wig, of course, inside a hairnet, an elastic band, and a wig cap. And that's all that was in the box. There was no pamphlet, no little manual or care instructions nothing like that that's all that came in the box so let's get into the construction of the wig so it's got three combs in the front a comb in the back the adjustable strap and okay this this is the bond part they have an elastic band that you can hook in there already for you it's already in there all you gotta do is hook it in there like a bra strap that's all you gotta do like why wouldn't you want this like they got that in there for you and then they got the bomb lace on it too. And they have the lace in the back. And this is how the lace looks. I'm gonna show that, put that clip over this. This is what the lace looks like. Super thin, like you can tell the difference between like the regular lace that you see, Swiss lace, or like just regular lace compared to this. Like this stuff is super thin and delicate and you have to be careful with it cause you can tear it very easily. But yeah, look how thin it is like I put it up against my skin like it's almost like blending up my skin I don't even have makeup on it yet like that's how thin it is so that's that so let's get into the details so this is their pre-plucked hide lace plus hide knots body wave lace wig I think this is under their undetectable lace or just the HD lace wig on the website I can't remember the tab that it was under but either way an undetectable HD it's both of them. It's undetectable to me. I don't see no lace. Do you see it? Thought so. I got a large cap size. Of course, I always get a large because my head is huge. Okay. The size for a large is 23.5 inch circumference. So, measure your head. Make sure you get the right size. That is very important. Like, I cannot stress that enough. You need the right cap size or it's going to be uncomfortable. If it's too small, it's going to be uncomfortable like you don't you ain't going to wear it so get the right cap size yeah and if you if you're getting somebody to install your wig like when i do hair please get the right cap size because i hate sitting there tugging on clients heads because they got a cap size that's too small like get your cap size the length is 22 inches i obviously cut layers in it so um might be a little bit shorter than that um but not really this is where it stops on me stretched out and i am 5'3 so yeah, 22 inches and it's a six inch lace front wig. So um, I'm guessing it's six inches of parting space, which I did notice that when I was like um, styling the hair, that it was a lot of parting space. Like this parting space goes way back here. Like, so six inches of parting space and then 13 inches across. Now let's get into my review on this hair so um obviously i mean y'all can already see that the lace itself is bomb like there's nothing to even say about that you can see that for yourself this lace is bomb like what do you want me to say what do you want me to say like you can see it you can see that like it melts so easy this is the easiest install i've ever done the best install i've ever done i don't have no issues no having to clean up or touch up nothing like as soon as i tied it down cut the lace off that was it and all I had to do was style it. So yeah, this was like a super easy wig to deal with. Like this is the easiest wig I've ever dealt with. And like I was so obsessed with the install. Like I was freaking out when I took the um I took the elastic band off after I had cut the lace off and everything. I was like, ain't no way. Like there is no way that I did this. Like ain't no way this look like this. Like wow. I did wash it before I install it because I usually have problems with like when I order hair, if I don't wash it, I like break out like rashes all around my face like so i have to wash my hair before i install it i always wash my hair before i install it i guess my skin is sensitive to virgin hair so i don't know but i did wash it i didn't get any shedding if i did it was like a couple strands maybe like two or three strands when i was washing it i did pluck it a little bit and i will insert the clip of how i looked before I plucked it in after. Not that you need to pluck it. I mean, it is pre-plucked, but I just wanted mine to look a little bit more like a hairline. You know, it's, it wasn't bad. And I didn't bleach the knots either. I didn't even bleach the knots. So, 
All I did was pluck it and um, yeah, I didn't pluck that much out of it though. The shedding, I don't have any problems with that. I, I don't get any shedding like running my fingers through it at all, like none. Even when I comb it, I don't really, I don't get any shedding. Yeah, the only time it shed, it was like a few strands when I was washing it and blow drying it. And that's expected, so. But other than that, like I had no problems with this wig, none at all, so. I don't have no complaints about it. None, like what, what could I possibly say? What could I possibly say? And then it's got the elastic band in the bag. That you can just like, you don't have to, you know, a lot of companies, I mean, they did send an elastic band that you could sew in there, but you don't even need that. A lot of companies just send an elastic band by itself. You gotta attach it in there. Everybody don't know how to do that. So all you gotta do is hook it in there. Y'all know how, y'all know how bra straps work. Bra strap, just hook it on there, like, and that's it. Your elastic band is in your wig. So I don't have no complaints about this hair, none at all. Like this is the best wig I've ever worked with. Now I'm not gonna say that this is the best company ever because I haven't tried every company. So um, I haven't tried too many companies, but so far this is the best wig I have ever worked with. The best company, the best lace I've ever worked with. Like no complaints, no complaints. We'll see if I can find a company that tops them, but so far, Superb Wigs is up there. They up there. So, these other companies just step their game up because Superb Wigs got y'all beat right now. Okay? Period. That's really all I have to say. Like, this wig is just bomb. Like, I really don't have nothing else to say. So, that's it for today's video. I hope y'all enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, please. And thank you. And turn on your post notifications so you don't ever miss when I post because you don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. So make sure you have your post notifications on and I will see y'all in my next video, which is I'm filming on Sunday. What's Sunday? Sunday, December 29th. And I leave for my trip for New York on December 30th. So um, I don't know when the video will go up, but I am filming it on December 29th and it will go up sometime that week. And then the week after that, y'all will get the New York vlog because I'll be in New York next week. Okay, for New Year's. So yeah, turn on your post notifications, subscribe so you don't miss those videos because I promise you, Sunday's video, you don't want to miss. I got some heat for y'all, as always. So um, yeah, thank y'all so much for watching and I'll see y'all next time. Bye.